Scientists in China, get this, put a human gene into a monkey. They think they can make the monkeys more intelligent. Stop me if you've seen this movie. This is Healthcare Triage News. In the immortal words of Patton Oswalt, science, we're all about coulda, not so much about shoulda. To the research. In a study published recently in the National Science Review in Beijing, scientists took the human gene NCPH1, which plays a role in brain development, and put it into monkey embryos through a virus that contained the gene. They did this to 11 monkeys, not 12, 11. Six of them died. The remaining five didn't have significantly different brain development, but they did do a bit better on some memory tasks in the short term. They also had brains which developed more like human brains, even if they wound up more like monkey brains. Because they don't care that they're literally enacting a movie, they're going to use viruses to inject other human genes into monkeys. One is thought to be involved in human intelligence. The other is involved with language ability because they want Planet of the Apes to happen. Or Frankenstein. What will the scientists do with the monkeys if they succeed? When these animals feel all alone in the universe, do they think that the monkeys will love their creators? Forget the fact that they also killed half the monkeys. I'm sure the new smarter monkeys will totally understand. I'm sure the virus will be contained. I'm sure none of this will bite us all in the butt. One of the scientists who did this says it would be unethical to do it in apes because apes are too much like us and because it's called Planet of the Apes. Because monkeys split off from us evolutionarily 25 million years ago, he thinks that this is safer and more ethical. Until we get Planet of the Monkeys, that's all I've got here. I literally just cannot believe that anyone thinks this is a good idea and that we're not all horrified and shutting down this ridiculousness right now. We know where this ends. It's not a good place for the humans on the planet. Hey, did you like this video? Always helps if you like or subscribe. And if you'd like to see a better use of gene therapy, you might enjoy this episode on GMOs. While we've got you, another good way to support the show is Patreon.com, a subscription service that allows you, the viewer, to support the show in any way you like. We'd especially like to thank our research associate, Joe Sevitz, and of course, our Surgeon Admiral, Sam.